So to ensure that this document, this revised document, would not be worm eaten, what did Shabaka do? He had it written on a block of stone, basalt, which is one of the hardest stones uh, on the planet. And that stone is now in the British Museum. It's known as the Shabaka Stone. And the significance of the Shabaka Stone is that it records the oldest story of Genesis ever written by human beings. An African story about the beginning, about the Neturu, creating that a netter creating the netter who created the world so it's taking genesis back uh further than you can ever imagine so this is deep spiritual thought man this is deep science uh and this is what the kushites reintroduced into kemet during the 25th dynasty uh and it is what uh jan asman in his book the mind of egypt referred to as the first renaissance in history